Hey, what's up? It's Rogue Pro here, and we are going to talk about DNS because faster DNS really matters if we are browsing through the internet or gaming or what else we want to do there. Faster DNS really matters. Now, we are going to look into how we can find the fastest DNS depending on our location and how we are going to set this one up on our computer so that the response when we are browsing will be much faster. Slower DNS means it's going to slow down how you are going to use the internet. Poof. Just jump into your laptop and fire up any browser you have there. For me, I'll have Google Chrome. Go to your address bar and type in GRC com I'll just put this link on the description below so that you can just click that one and go there we are going to benchmark DNS name servers <laughs> so are your DNS servers impeding your entering experience we don't know so we are going to use this one you can optimize your internet connection if you can measure your DNS servers so <laughs> that's why we have DNS benchmark very simple tool you can download this one done downloading so we are going to open that one run there you go just go ahead and click on name servers and then this will start to search for the name servers so it will take a few seconds to do it after scanning we can go ahead and click on our run benchmark after clicking that one this will try to test every name server that is there with a given response time so we can actually see that this is being arranged the first one to be the fastest now this will take uh, about a minute to scan so we'll just wait for a while and let's try to see which one comes first Let's give this one a fast forward so that it will be much, much faster to see the results. But in a normal speed, this will take you from three to five minutes. So just take your time. The test is done, just go for nap now. We can start to evaluate the results that we have here. Now we have the 8.8.4.4 .8 .4 .4 as the first one that's the Google public DNS we also have the 1.1.1 .1 .1 that is your Cloudflare that other people say that it is much faster than your Google public DNS but I still have my Google public DNS as the fastest one let's click on the tabular data so we can further evaluate the data that we have here so we have the response time minimum average maximum and um, there you have it we have your 8.8.4.4 as the fastest one so we are going to go with uh, the Google public DNS now these results vary from location to location maybe your Cloudflare might be faster in, in your location or that 9.9.9 .9 would be faster in your location it all depends but for me again as I have said Google still has it now let's get that DNS server IP address and go and change our DNS server settings so that we can optimize our internet connection here on our computer just go ahead and type settings on your search bar settings and then go to your network and internet you have your Wi-Fi if you are using Wi-Fi go for the Wi-Fi if you are not using Wi-Fi you are using Ethernet go to the Ethernet adapter and change that one go for change adapter options click this one and then you can see my Wi-Fi adapter here right click then go to properties and then you can see internet protocol version 4 you double click this one and then this is where the IP address goes in but we are having the IP address automatically so what we need to change is the DNS we are going to use static DNS I'm going to put 8.8.8 oh I mean 4.4 that's the public DNS and the same time the backup DNS would be 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8. that's the same with Google so Google public DNS has two that's 8.8.4.4 .8 .4 and 8.8.8 .8 .8. okay 
and then OK, and then um, you want to check the one if has changed. You you can right click again here, click on status, and then details. You can see there IPv4 DNS servers 8.8.4.4 and 8.8.8.8. There you have it, and you can try if something has changed. So once again, guys, this is Toroga Pro. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, like my videos, and share it to everybody else. Enjoy. Until next time, goodbye.